little hinges swing big doors. It's a quote by W. Clement Stone, and it essentially means that the small things we do open the door to the big things in life. You know, mountains are made of single rocks. Oceans are single waves. Symphonies are individual notes. Conversations are individual words. Progress is nothing more than the ability to break big things down into small things. That's it. And those manageable pieces, day in and day out, they become the roadmap to accomplish whatever it is you set out to accomplish. And I love the metaphor of a door, right? The simplicity. It's just a door. But without that little hinge, it doesn't function the same. It'd be impossible to open and close. It would be far less useful, all because of this little hinge. This trivial little thing. It's an afterthought. It's a small detail hidden behind the main attraction, which is one of life's greatest truths. You know, we see and we celebrate the obvious things, the big things, the mountaintops. We do so to the extent that we forget the extraordinary is just a product of the, the tiny, uncool, unsexy, unremarkable actions and decisions. We forget what swings the door open. So why is this valuable? Well, when you personally can identify and control the little things in your life, it becomes greatly apparent that nothing is truly out of reach. All options are open. And it's not because of, of destiny or, or magic or the fact that anyone deserves anything. No, it, it's, it's simply realizing that every great accomplishment occurs one step at a time, and that's all. Anyone can take a single step. Anyone can write a single word. And when you break down the greats, that's what they say, right? Kobe talks about breaking his day into consistent, measurable sessions at the gym. Schwarzenegger talks about building his body one rep at a time. Will Smith talks about the methodical practice, the preparation he takes one line at a time. These are hinges. They happen to open the door to NBA records. They open the door to, you know, the becoming the world's strongest man. They open the door to Hollywood success. And let's take it even deeper. Personally, I can identify smaller things off the top of my head that have uh, a 10x multiplier on my day. Right? For me, there's a direct correlation between waking up early and being successful. A successful, productive, happy day. Because I jump out of bed, I feel good, and it carries through. It's a very simple equation. When I get up early, my day's better. Small thing, huge impact. Right? Or having good, healthy food in my fridge makes me feel good means I don't rush out to get food somewhere at the last minute. I can plan and I eat well and I feel better. Being around productive, high energy, positive people makes me perform well, period. It causes me to level up. When I remove the negativity, when I surround myself with success, I grow. When I do the opposite, I rationalize mediocrity. It's that simple. You know, these simple things have exponential impact on my journey. They are, you could say, the smallest of hinges, and they played and continue to play a role in opening some of the largest doors I've walked through. The challenge is that, you know, it's easy to brush them off as insignificant or trivial because they are so small. You know, that's always been the obstacle, illuminating and quantifying their value. But when you do, when that light bulb sort of goes off, it's a remarkable transition, right? The, the differentiator uh, for me between waking up at 5.30 and eight it's not two and a half hours. That's not the value. The value is the momentum. It's getting my first win before the world wakes up and embodying that success. At the end of the day, it's mediocrity versus growth. That's just how I am. That's how I feel. That is my tiny hinge. That is my advantage. Now, obviously, those are going to vary, right? Not everyone needs to wake up early. But I would advocate finding what makes you tick, finding that little hinge, paying attention, seeking out simple steps that have tremendous impact. Whether it's consistency, who you spend your time with, the courage to take a single step, try something new, these are seeds that often become the difference. You don't get substantial results without mastering the pieces that create the foundation. 
And when you remember what actually makes that door open, you put yourself in a position to walk through.